Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial that's uh, like uh, the seventh if I'm not wrong. So actually people asked me, okay now I know to um, insert AI, I know to put reinforcements, I know uh, to reveal specific uh, locations on maps, but how the hell I am actually am I actually supposed to play it? So it's going to be very fast, hopefully. So I I'm uh, will explain how uh, this thing works actually. So gonna go ahead open one map, something randomly. One of my many Dune folders, because I have a lot, like uh, five of them just for um, you know practice and edit, and one for multiplayer. So yeah, the map doesn't matter. So now just uh, let's add some uh, crap. Let's say the player is Atreides. Also, it's uh, kind of important to uh, have your mission look good. But that's when you are a little bit more advanced in uh, map editing. At the beginning, it doesn't really matter. You just have to uh, get your stuff working. And after that, you can start thinking about nice designs of bases and uh, all that kind of crap. So, not going to waste very much time on uh, this because it's really up to the up to each player and map maker. So, uh, I uh, like repair facilities a lot for some reason, even that they are kind of useless. So, uh, yeah. So you have the uh, your base here, and let's say very pretty damn retarded mission that you have just to kill a very weak Ordos player here he has only uh, so yeah uh, these these stars if you don't know are starting locations for multiplayer maps so uh, they represent uh, the starting MCV in uh, multiplayer matches and uh, these uh, things, circles, or whatever, are worm spawners. So it's the location where the worms will spawn. So in multiplayer, if you choose one, it will uh, uh, be only one of them. If you choose uh, two and three, you got it. These are the spice blooms, and this is the actual spice, If you, in case you didn't know all this. Um, yeah. So uh, not really important how uh, the base looks because we want to do it fast so um, okay so now that uh, you have uh, the map the map file prepared I'm gonna go and uh, save it now uh, this is a uh, something people didn't understand uh, you can't really uh, make new uh, names here unless there is a possibility to combine it with uh, the mission select mod I did not try that before actually I will so um, if uh, I'm going to make it so I'll find a new way to use different uh, map names then I will uh, uh, make a video but you have uh, until now to use the actual mission files from the game from the stock game so this uh, uh in this mission the player is a uh, the human player is a Atreides as i said so you are going to need to choose from uh, an Atreides mission now how you know uh, which house uh how you know the example uh, for example this one you see it's a two v one dot map. The first letter uh, re means the house. So Atreides. A, A, the H comes from Harkonnen and the O from Ordos. It's quite easy. Now the second one. Uh, it's the number of the mission. This is mission one, mission two, and mission three, six, seven, whatever. Uh, the V and uh, the next number actually means the version of the map so now you know when you are uh, playing with the campaign map screen like the original way 
you have to choose uh, between two uh, two territories in the first uh, three missions and missions missions six and nine so that's uh, the two versions of the map uh, are actually those territories so that's about the file name hopefully you got it now so just save it as uh, something randomly I can't remember which one this was so just um, save it like let's say okay oh actually this was a multiplayer map so it doesn't matter okay so now you have the first mission of Atreides and it will look uh, like this but uh, all the reinforcements all the mission con conditions the win um, trigger the starting money and all the crap will actually be in the miss file so that's uh, very important open missionator then open the you have to open the exit uh, same uh, mission file yeah this was okay then now you can start adding crap whatever you like and uh, that's about it so um, also people really forget about how to export and import AI I have a tutorial for that I want to remember you so go ahead and check it I think it's number four so yeah uh, yeah this is not the original miss file it's actually from my new Atreides campaign I think yeah okay so I think I should talk about these too but I doubt it's so hard to understand but probably I will but in our tutorials so that's gonna be about it for now it was uh, done by request this tutorial so I hope uh, that guy who asked me and uh, all others understood now how to play these missions so see you next time